everybody and welcome to today's 613 Freeze Stories and today I'm going to be reading you a story in this book called Christmas Stories for Children called The Tired Little Christmas Angel. Just before Christmas the angels are crafting and baking in the Christmas workshop. Those who are still too small work as stair polishers how hard they work to scrub wash and polish the stairs says tilda the angel in charge to jo jonas pert 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 what was that sophie one of the little angels flutters past with an empty basket tilda and jonas watch her how slowly Sophie flies. Jonas wonders she's the one who has to collect the children's wish lists this time and she needs to hurry up. Is she looking for something? Why does she look some, sometimes to the right? Sometimes to the left, curious, the big angels fly after her. Heavens above, shouts Tilda. The little angel has chosen a soft cloud bed and is fast asleep. Tilda and Jonas shrug their shoulders, laugh and fly to earth in Sophie's place. They peer through the window into the nursery. Just look how eagerly these children are crafting gifts, Tilda says in amazement. Almost like the angels in the heavenly workshop, Jonas laughs. Just imagine if the children could see us, Tilda quickly pulls him away from the window. Remember the wish lists. The angels fly along. Suddenly they hear a shrill, a shrill child's voice call. Clear the path! And then they spot many children in the snow. They whisk down the hill on skis, sledges and snowboards. It's been a long, long time since we were last on earth, says Tilda. The angels watch the children for a while, then they hurry on to the next town. From the roof of a st stall at the Christmas market, Jonas watches a girl at the chestnut stall. My gift for Daddy, she says, pointing at her bike. If there's any left by the time Christmas comes around, her mother laughs. The baby on the sled spots Jonas and shouts. Fa, 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 pointing up with his finger. The mother looks up, but she cannot see the angel. Quick to work. Tilda reminds him, the angels return to heaven with the Christmas post. Tilda shakes little Sophie awake, sleepily she mumbles. Get up, Dolly, you've slept long enough. I have lots to do on earth. We helped a little, says Jonas, and puts the letters into the basket because your doll was so tired. Soon, Sophie's polishing the stairs with the other angels the end i hope you enjoyed that story in this book called christmas stories for children and yes so enjoy the rest of your day afternoon evening because it's kind of getting into evening now so enjoy the rest of your day or evening and the storm is gone and so enjoy the rest of your day everybody and it looks like my brother isn't coming up so don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the post notification bell share and follow me on instagram and so and watch more of my videos so bye everybody good luck see you all tomorrow for day 631 of Reese's stories so bye everybody good luck